Well, now to a major traffic change starting just before Monday morning rush hour. It's going to be a major headache for drivers on the east side of Colorado Springs for at least the next three weeks. The widening road project is happening at the south end of Mark Shuffle Road. If you travel a two mile stretch between Bradley Road and Fontaine Boulevard, you will now have to detour at Powers Boulevard. Now, Caradio News Channel 13, Scott Harrison is live there to explain what he's learned about this road work. Scott? Well, the road, the entire, this two stretch of road is going to be closed so that the immediate area where we're at right now can be widened from two lanes to four lanes. And that's to accommodate a 2,000 unit housing complex in this area we're standing right now. And construction starts on that this summer. Now, that project, this project to widen the road is going to provide several important benefits, but also create some inconveniences for people who travel and live along this route. The flashing road sign misspells Mark Sheffield Road and doesn't have the starting date quite right, but it hammers the point home. Two miles of one of the area's busiest roads will close until early June to widen it for a forthcoming housing development. The million dollar project is being financed through bond sales by a local metro district. And we're trying to make sure that we stay out ahead of that growth and development as opposed to doing it piecemeal on an ad hoc basis. So yeah, we're trying, we, we have the unique ability at Bradley Heights to construct the roads and capacity ahead of growth. The head traffic engineer for Colorado Springs, which approved the project, said that it's the best way to finish the widening sooner and keep workers safe. But he understands that regular users of this route and people who live along or near it will be inconvenienced. You know, this, you know, it's going to be a detour. Uh, and there's going to be impact on, on the flow on their commute time. Uh, and um, I ask, yeah, as I ask all the traveling public, please be patient. Uh, this is temporary. Um, and we'll do our best in the terms of operating traffic signals to accommodate the flow of traffic the best we can. But people we spoke with today have mixed feelings about this project. We'll hear from them coming up at 6. In southeastern Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.